Elemental challenge, starting through the periodic table, episode 19. Ruthenium. Let's go for Ruthenium. My teacher said Ruthenium is an element that combines danger and beauty. <gasps> Have you heard of the spider lily? There's an experiment with Ruthenium that blooms like a spider lily in the dark night. Spider lily? Isn't that? Yes. Let's find out. Reminder. No imitation. This is elemental ruthenium, one of the rarest metals in nature. Its concentration in the Earth's crust is only one-tenth that of gold. Today's star is its compound, ruthenium chloride. We'll use it to create a dazzling spider lily-like blue. Put it into a three-necked flask. Add two tube by pyrophene and a small amount of sodium hypophosphite solution. Transfer it to a heating pad and install a condenser reflux apparatus. At this point, the solution is black. But after 40 minutes... Oh, it really looks like the color of a spider lily. But how does it bloom? You'll see soon enough. Huh? After trying the product, we get an orange-red powder. Tris 2 2 by pyridine ruthenium 2 chloride. Like the legend of spider lily, it's vibrant and alluring, but also toxic. <gasps> you call that alluring? <laughs> now, let the show begin. Like many people, I used to think of chemistry as almost synonymous with danger, something to be avoided. But then, I realized that the true purpose of science is not to shy away from the unknown and the fear it brings, but to explore and uncover the beauty and wonders hidden within. Just like this substance, despite its terrifying nature, when exposed to ultraviolet light and dropped into water, it will... Thank <laughs> you.